tell you probably people might have forgotten uh, and let me tell you who am i and what are my credentials i think uh, when i was in class 10 i got 100 out of 100 in mathematics i got a you know government a certificate from government i also got 191 out of 200 because we have 200 marks exam uh once again got a government certificate from west bengal government uh, for scoring such high marks uh, i entered into st jbs college kolkata where somewhere there in some wall my name should be there because i ranked first in st jbs college in maths department i have a rank of 25th in calcutta university now i can i can't show all of this you know pictures and images because all these are there but that would be tremendous level of editing and in fact in order to create this video i have to do a lot of editing because there are some funny stuffs that i have you know captured uh so that is one thing right uh, there was a program called mathematical talent search i don't know that is uh, conducted till now so i was the only person who is recommended by my hod of uh, math department uh, it was held in in mysore so i i was a participant there they, they do not give certificate but there were around i think uh, 52 people out of those 52 people i ranked fifth in the mts there was some exam uh, there are exam like iit called iit jam uh, in which i ranked uh, but i ranked at the end i mean not not a good rank there however there is also that exam called indian statistical institute which is isi uh, and i i i cleared the exam i i, I was the topper in that exam there were 21 people who were selected over the entire india and i was the one in that 21 so i think uh, you know and also i took cat i got 96 percentile in cat and uh, out of that in maths i got 99.82 uh, percentile the only you know subject that i hate or i i did not get good marks was uh, english where i got 70 percentile otherwise i would have scored more than 99 percentile in that so i think uh, other than that if you talk about my other certifications right i am, the, I am excel expert certified from microsoft sql certified from microsoft sas base and advanced certified from sas solvency 2 certified from solvency 2 body that is located in europe Uh, FRM level one cleared as well. Fourteen papers of actually, right? So I think uh, I have done some work, right? And I have the credentials, and that is why probably I am in this business because uh, that that's the that's my sole fight was because no paper actually, right? Now why I am calling these people paper actually because they don't have knowledge because they don't have uh, time to kind of follow me, but they have time to put allegation in an abusive manner uh, to. on me right and uh, i think the final uh, credential would be probably shared by an offer letter i am i can't share my current salary or maybe because i am not working right now or the previous salary because that's a confidentiality agreement but i can share an offer uh, that i've got although i'll not be you know kind of mentioning the i'll probably blur out the uh, you know the the portion uh, of the company which gave me that offer but you can un- understand that is a big four company and uh, just for i leave, leave you to your imagination but that is usually that is known by two words so i'll ju- just leave that to your imagination what that company is right once again i'll go back to sharing my screen and there i'll show you the salary this will serve you two purpose too. first of all uh, in business even in a corporate environment why would someone you know uh, Uh, you know pay you salary right because you are able to give more value to that company suppose someone is paying you a salary of 20 lakhs then probably that person or that company is expecting 30 lakhs from your side right so in case you are getting a high package then that means you have established that credibility also in your current company you have established this credibility otherwise because if your salary is not 50 lakhs no one is going to give you 60 lakhs package right so your current salary has to be higher so that means in your current company you have shown some you know skill some uh, you know potential and that's based on that the other companies have interviewed you they have considered you suitable and then uh, for the position they have hired you they have you know kind of uh, offered you a salary right so let me go to the salary part i have kind of and someone might say oh you you have created this salary right so uh, i'll blur out few portions but i'll once again Uh, share my uh, you know screen and go to the uh, go to this so this is yeah this you can see uh, this is my email account and uh, here i have got this uh, email right and uh, there is an attachment here of a letter right so i have kind of uh, you know downloaded that attachment 
right? And that attachment is kind of open here, which is the salary. So if you see here, the salary that I'm, this is the overall CTC, that salary is coming out to be 77 lakhs, right? And uh, like in, in actually there is a, a saying that actually is get one quote package. So I'm very close to that. Package, well, this right? date was June 20, 2022. It is approximately one year back. Uh, and you can gauge uh, what could be my salary at that this point of time because I got two increments after that. One was mid year increment and then there was the annual increment. Although by the time. Naam kya tha tha nahi. Hai. Aur ka. I would have switched now, right? My salary would be more than one crore. Like that's that you can probably gauge that, right? The knowledge why do you stop at one crore, right? You should go much beyond one crore, thousand crore, two thousand crore. And why, uh, like maybe one question that I'd like to answer, why someone who is in a business would like to, you know, teach, like, for example, uh, do I not have the confidence that I can, you know, make uh, that money from, from trading, right? Why I'm earning money uh, from uh, maybe coaching, right? The first, I mean, the first reason is uh, that when you are in a business, it's an unstable income, unlike salary, right? So some, there, might, there may be months where I will not be making profit, right? In those months, that income would help me, right? Because I don't have a stable income, right? Also, there is a lot of value for my time, right? For example, I'm making this video, I'll have to edit this video, right? So there is a lot of, you know, uh, uh, like, like my time is very valuable. So if I'm spending 90 minutes every day, if I'm trying to explain things to someone, especially in a profession where 1% is profitable and 99% makes losses, which is much more difficult uh, than actually, right? Because we have seen so many paper actuaries and that's the whole idea, the like whole purpose of, you know, starting my YouTube channel in actually was that uh, there are too many people who have cleared papers, but with very limited knowledge, who have a lot of attitude like this sort of people, right? So uh, that's uh, that's the problem that, that we face uh, in corporate. And I, I thought that if I leave corporate and I do this, then uh, there is a vacuum that I can feel, right? There is a there is a gap. So that I you created a bad situation for me, Akshay and uh, Piyush. But uh, I actually, you know, I think I uh, utilize the situation pretty well, right? And second thing is that as an actual student, you can dream of, you know, a good package if you have the knowledge, right? Also, why would you, you know, uh, come to me for coaching? Because I have been there, done that, right? Uh, because maybe in other coaching center, with due respect to them, they have not reached that level. They can't tell you how to reach maybe a 80 lakhs package or one crore package because they themselves have not done that, right? So I can tell you that, right? So I think that's that's my USP, right? I, 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 I have that to, you know, I, I, I have the proof, right? 